He let it go. He let it go. He says I'm on the take. Let it. You want to avoid suspension? You bring me proof that Rachel Adair was murdered by Sonny Corinthos. What the hell are you thinking? Jump in the DA. He says I'm on Sonny's payroll. You just gave Durant the leverage that he wanted. Okay, you know, you know what? It's about that crack you made about my money problems. So what? Yeah. No one joins a force to get rich. Yeah, most cops aren't letting their fiancés pay their medical bills by having another man's baby either. Dr. Thomas? Keep an eye out. How about you keep an eye out? I don't know, Jason. I'm a quick hold, please. Michael's file. Anything interesting? No, I mean, it's a, it's a bunch of handwritten notes. Nothing new. AJ is mentioned here, but... Oh, it's Michael's biological file. Here's my... Here's my file. On his desk? Yeah, it's a file... around the time of my accident. My charts and test results. Is there anything in there? Okay, Monica said the second crisis happened January 17th, right? Yeah. That page from my charts missing. All these years, and now I realize it. My God, that second crisis in the middle of the night that never should have happened was a murder attempt. You tried to murder our son. How can you say that, Monica? Because two days earlier, Tony Jones had told us that Jason was going to be a vegetable. Our beautiful boy, who was going to be a doctor, was going to live a, a living death. And you couldn't stand that, could you, Alan? No, I couldn't. And neither could you. But I would never do him any harm. Oh, yes, you could. Because you went to his room and you gave him something to stop his heart. God knows what damage you did. He could have been dead if they hadn't come in and then revived him. You are probably responsible for his memory loss. Do you know that? I didn't try to kill Jason, Monica. What? What are you talking about? I saved his life. What? On that night, I went up to Jason's room, and I was just going to sit with him for a few minutes. And the machine's alarms went off. And I revived him before the ICU staff even got there. My God, why didn't you tell me this? Because I hesitated for a moment and thought to myself, maybe Jason would be better off dead than alive. Oh. And I was so ashamed for that moment that I hesitated. I could never bring myself to tell you. But I assure you, Monica, it was me who saved our son's life. for January 17th. All the days around it, but not for the day my heart stopped. All right, well, that can't be a coincidence. Someone must have destroyed the records of the time you almost died, and I would take bets that it was Dr. Those Thomas. Those records could have been destroyed any time in the past 10 years by anyone. Including AJ? Why, why would he want to? I don't know, Jason. Maybe that is the connection between AJ and Dr. Thomas. Maybe AJ wanted to change your record somehow. What? 
Well, there must have been something on this tape that someone didn't want us to hear. Find what you were looking for? 